Yo, it's the Sauce Go here, back with another video, and today I'm about to tell you the best free phone app to use for CPNs. I made a cool 50 piece, and that was just in a few weeks. I'm stuck up on BNB, I'm racked up on BNB. So when you're just building the CPNs, you may not want to totally get a, a, a new phone for it or a real track phone for it yet. You may just want to get something like so you can get it started to get it going and so that's where i think the best app to use would be talk of tone talk of tone is a good app um you can download on the app store it all you need is an email to lock to sign up and they just send the code to the email so it's real easy you don't need like a phone number or anything like on google voice and it's free to download free to use just sign up with the email um now it will if, if you do want to receive codes this is the thing i like about it also too when building a CPN, like if you need an email, like, cause this, this is how like the process of building a CPN, you know, first you have to get the email. You first you get the name, the date of birth, everything you want to have, the number, but then you put, you have to get an email and then a phone number because you know, when you go to um, submit your public records, when you go to like do all the, um, the inquiry, like public, like when you do um, public records and pre-approvals, you feel me? Once you're doing all those, you're going to need an email, you're going to need a phone number. So the email, you can go ahead and go to Gmail. And there's a little trick too. If you choose Matt to manage my business, when you're creating the account of the Gmail, um, you can just go and you can even use your phone or whatever. Maybe just use um, incognito mode. It works like this because Gmail, they're going to see that same IP. You feel me? If you use an incognito mode, it's, it's different or a VPN. But if, if you're just using the same one, they're going to see that same IP. And so they're not going to, they're only going to let you make like a certain amount. And even with, if you change your IP on that new IP, you can only make a certain amount too, like one or two. After you try to make a third one on the same IP, it's just going to block you. Or it's also going to um, ask for a, a phone number to link with it. But it, you know, you don't want that to happen. So hopefully when you do it with the, um, with the manage my business, because even sometimes with the manage my business, it can do it. But if you, it's, it's less to trigger it that way. So this is a little way to go around it because when you try to open a personal account, a lot of times you're going to want the phone number. So all you got to do is go to, to manage my business and you feel me just and do it in incognito mode is separate and they're not going to ask for a phone number. It'll be optional. And that's when you can go ahead and just make your, make your, um, email, you know what I'm saying? Make your Gmail, whatever name that you want it to be. And boom, that's how you get in really easily. Now, once you get the Gmail, you can go and make the talk of tone. Like I said, you just, use that email to sign up for the talk and they're going to send the code out to the email. So it makes it really easy. And then you go and choose a number and set up a number and you could also choose any area code you want. So you pick the first three and then they'll give you a random selection of numbers. So it's really easy. That's how you can get your phone and get your email right there for your CPN. This is just be your first number, your first phone to get, just to have something to get started. You feel me for now? Um, just so you can start your CPN, you know what I'm saying? Cause you're going to need some type of phone number. But you may not always want to go ahead and invest with the full, go get a track phone. You know, you could go pay 20, 30 bucks for a track phone and then pay 20, 30 bucks for the plan and to activate it. So that's how you could get it. And, and this is actually better. It's the real way you want to go when you like really want to build your CPM. Like if you really want to do it for the long term. But once again, that's cost money, you know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. So if you just want to set it up and get it going and there's a lot of things that you can do and I'm gonna let you know what you can get without even, with just a, a, a free text number. You know what I'm saying? Like you could open bank accounts cause, all right, so, I'm, so some, some bank accounts, some loans and like credit cards spots, they not, the VOIP number is not gonna fly for these loans and stuff like they, or some banks so like, they don't accept VOIP numbers. So you're gonna have to get a real number, you know what I'm saying? And VOIP stands for uh, Voice Over Internet Provider. So, you know, like these free apps that give you service. You feel me? So some of them don't mess with the VOIPs, but I'll tell you what you can get is you can get phones for show with just a random VOIP number. They're not worried about the number that you have. Um, a lot of store credit cards. Um, let me see what I know. I got personally like a Home Depot, Big Lots, Walmart, so Kohl's, so I know those, you feel me, you don't even, you, you can get a, I know those you can get approved for with the CP and you don't, you don't, you can have the VOIP number, it's cool. What else do you, let me see, a lot of, some bank accounts too. There's some bank accounts that you can get that they don't really, they're not tripping Chime, you can open up a Chime and it's when it comes to credit cards 
and loans, certain companies they're not gonna they're not gonna fly with this. You know, like they no VOIP number. They just won't even allow it. They won't accept it, or they may just deny your application based off that loan. So when you actually are trying to build it for big stuff, bigger than just little phones. Um, you probably can get cars with the VIP number. I don't think they really care like that. You can definitely get a house, a crib. You can um, get a lot of store credit cards like the four I named. So just the loans and the credit cards is where you are probably gonna run into a problem. But if you really wanna build your CP to be like a real legitimate CP and you wanna use it as if it's yours or something, definitely go ahead and eventually just get a real phone number. Like you can get a track phone or even if you go and uh, you know get a T-Mobile plan or whatever, sign up for them. You can use that number too and have that be, you know, whatever you want to do. But you want to eventually, if you really want to build it up and make it like a real solid profile, you want to um, get an actual real phone number. But a lot of times you don't need that, you know what I'm saying? Save the money, get the free number. If you need the code, pay the little four extra bucks to get the code, $4 a month. You can't beat that. But yeah, all right, I'm going to keep dropping some more sauce. So just like and subscribe. And uh, stay tuned in, stay tapped in, and, and hit me on uh, Telegram, join my free Telegram for more sauce, and just hit me and tap in if you need to uh, book a call, if you, you uh, want to join my pay chat, if you need any of my courses, just tap in. I also have a website, too, where you can buy it. But yeah, sauce go.